What if a visitor from beyond our solar system has arrived, not silently but purposefully, to rewrite everything we thought we knew about comets? Imagine the stillness of space itself holding its breath. In that infinite black ocean, a single spark emerges, not white, not blue, but glowing in an eerie emerald hue. It drifts through the void like a heartbeat made of light. This is 3i slash ATLAS, mysterious, ancient, alive, an interstellar traveler that has already begun to break every rule of cosmic behavior. When its strange light first reached our telescopes, astronomers expected a routine reading, just another frozen wanderer passing through the neighborhood of the sun. But what Harvard scientists found changed everything. Its motion didn't match known physics. Its tail flickered like a pulse instead of a stream. And its composition, the very materials that make it, seemed unlike any comet ever cataloged. 3i slash ATLAS isn't behaving like something born in our solar system. It's as if it carries a different kind of memory, one written in the language of other stars. If that thought sends a shiver down your spine, you're not alone. Because somewhere across the United States, from the deserts of Arizona to the snowy peaks of Colorado, countless eyes are now turning upward, watching that same green light in wonder. So before we journey deeper into this mystery, do something simple that helps this story reach more curious souls. Tap that like button so the universe knows you're still listening. Share this video with someone who still believes that discovery never ends. And if you haven't already, subscribe to Astro Mind, the channel where wonder, science, and imagination meet. Together we'll keep exploring the secrets the universe is finally ready to reveal. Now, let us follow the light of 3i slash ATLAS, the visitor that shouldn't exist. The night was calm, serene, almost uneventful until the universe decided to whisper a secret. In the still silence of Hawaii's mountaintop observatories, telescopes locked onto a distant streak of light. At first glance, it looked like just another comet wandering through the dark. But as the data began to flow into Harvard's servers, something felt off. The numbers didn't add up. The color, an eerie unnatural shade of green, shimmered with an intensity that defied everything astronomers expected. Its trajectory was erratic, almost playful, as if it refused to obey the laws of celestial mechanics. Within hours, what began as a quiet observation turned into a storm of questions. Emails, calls, and encrypted messages flashed across time zones. Harvard, NASA, and the European Space Agency, all comparing notes, all equally baffled. This wasn't a comet behaving like it should. Its brightness pulsed unpredictably. Its tail split into fragments that danced and reformed. And then came the most unsettling discovery. It was accelerating. Not slowing down as it should while moving away from the sun, but speeding up like something was pushing it. Imagine a traveler from beyond our solar system drifting closer, studying us, not through intent, but by design of its own mysterious nature. That night, Harvard didn't just record an object, they recorded a question the cosmos itself was asking. What are you willing to believe? In that fragile moment, curiosity turned into awe. Awe turned into unease, and unease into fear. Because this visitor, this glowing emerald phantom, was rewriting everything we thought we knew about comets, space, and perhaps even our place in the universe. In the vast language of the cosmos, Comets are among the most predictable storytellers. For centuries, we've known their patterns. Icy wanderers born from the frozen edges of our solar system, following long elliptical orbits around the sun. They heat up as they approach, releasing gas and dust that form a glowing tail. Their behavior is elegant, mathematical, beautifully consistent. Every motion, every sparkle can be traced back to gravity and sunlight the two silent sculptors of the universe, but 3i slash ATLAS broke the script. From the very first data set, Harvard scientists noticed something impossible. It wasn't following the gravitational curve expected of a natural object. Instead of slowing as it left the sun's influence, it accelerated, 
as if propelled by an invisible force. Its composition, analyzed through spectral data, was even stranger. The elements in its glowing green coma didn't match anything cataloged in known comets. Traces of compounds were found that hinted at materials forged under extreme conditions, perhaps from another star system entirely or from processes we don't yet understand. To understand how strange this is, you must first know what should happen. When sunlight strikes a comet, the heat causes frozen gases to vaporize, pushing the comet slightly, a process called outgassing. But 3I slash ATLAS doesn't simply drift under sunlight. Its acceleration is erratic, uneven, and far stronger than expected. It behaves as if something inside it is awake. Comparisons were drawn to Oumuamua, the mysterious cigar-shaped object that visited our solar system in 2017. But while Oumuamua was silent, cold, and inert, 3I slash ATLAS seemed alive, flickering, breathing, pulsing with energy. It was as if the universe had taken the blueprint of a comet and rewritten it. For the first time, scientists are forced to consider that nature's rules, as we know them, might be incomplete. And when that happens, science doesn't panic, it listens. Because every rule that breaks is a door opening to something greater. As the weeks passed, Harvard's data stream filled with strange patterns that refused to be dismissed as errors. Each night, telescopes around the world turned toward the Emerald Wanderer, feeding petabytes of information into global servers. What began as a comet study soon transformed into a full-scale cosmic investigation. The numbers told a story that didn't make sense. Its tail, that glowing green ribbon, wasn't behaving like vaporized ice. Instead of a steady solar-driven stream, it pulsed. Every few hours, the brightness fluctuated in a rhythm, a heartbeat a cosmic pulse that appeared too regular, too deliberate, to be random. Scientists first blamed equipment calibration errors, but after cross-checking data from Hawaii, Chile, and even the European Southern Observatory, the same pulse appeared, identical in timing, identical in strength. Soon after, faint electromagnetic signatures appeared, embedded within the light spectrum of 3I slash ATLAS. They didn't match solar radiation or cosmic rays or any known natural emission. They were structured, harmonics that suggested order, like chords played on an invisible instrument. Harvard astrophysicists stayed cautious. None wanted to use the word artificial. But privately, in quiet conference calls, that word hung heavy in the air. Data analysts converted the pulses into sound, revealing a low repeating hum, rising and falling in perfect intervals too deliberate to ignore, too haunting to explain. It was as if the object were alive, not biological, but aware, responding to something unseen. We must be careful. Human imagination can project intention where there is none. But sometimes, chaos hides intelligence beyond our understanding, and 3I slash ATLAS seemed to know it was being watched. By now, 3I slash ATLAS had become the most watched object in the sky. Every major observatory, NASA's infrared telescopes, the European Space Agency's deep sky monitors, had its sensors locked on. Data flowed in from every corner of the globe. Private observatories, amateur astronomers, even university labs, all captivated by its strange glow and impossible behavior. Yet from official institutions, there was silence. In science, silence can mean two things. Either we know nothing, or we know something we cannot yet explain. NASA's public statements grew cautious. Words like unclassified spectrum, photometric irregularity, and potential anomaly appeared in reports. Harvard's press team, normally quick to share discoveries, issued brief reports that raised more questions than they answered. No conclusions, no bold claims, just hesitation. Behind the scenes, encrypted communications hinted at shared concern. Data once public became restricted or delayed. In the world of open science, such silence speaks volumes. Was this object emitting unknown signals? Was its acceleration artificially controlled? And if so, by what? Perhaps they remain quiet not to deceive, but because the truth itself may still be forming. The universe does not wait for us to understand. 
Three I slash ATLAS continues its journey. Its green pulse, a quiet reminder that all of Earth is now listening, and perhaps it is listening back. Every time we think we've written the final chapter of the universe, a new visitor arrives to remind us our book of knowledge is still being written. Harvard's models suggest that 3I slash ATLAS carries isotopes and trace elements from environments far older than our sun. One theory proposes it is the frozen heart of a shattered star system, a remnant of a sun that lived and died long before our world existed. Its green light could be the chemical signature of exotic ices never before seen. Others whisper different possibilities. Could the rhythmic energy releases be deliberate? Could this be a fragment of an ancient structure once capable of storing or transmitting vast amounts of energy, a relic of intelligence now drifting silently across interstellar space? Science is about chasing truth, not declaring it. If this object could speak, its story might stretch across galaxies, a message written in light from civilizations long gone. And yet it may also be nothing more than frozen gas and dust sculpted by forces we barely understand. Perhaps the universe is reminding us that it still has secrets and that we are only beginning to listen. What you are seeing is not just a comet but the heartbeat of the cosmos. Its glow pulses gently, deliberately, as if echoing the rhythm of time itself. Every flicker reminds us that even in the coldest corners of the universe, something stirs, something remembers, something endures. The color green dominates life, growth, renewal. Yet here in the void, it also becomes mystery and paradox. The comet's emerald light reflects the eternal cycle of creation and decay, reminding us that wonder never fades, it transforms. Even in our golden years, the universe still has the power to surprise us. Perhaps this green heart is telling us something deeper, that curiosity does not retire, that even as our bodies age, our minds can still reach across the cosmos and feel its pulse in our own hearts. The universe is alive and in its glow, so are we. Einstein spoke of a cosmic order, patterns that whisper of intelligence beyond our understanding. What if 3I slash ATLAS is not simply a comet, but a fragment of that intelligence? Its pulses, its motion, its green glow, perhaps these are echoes of the universe remembering itself. Time may not flow linearly here. Past, present, and future could intertwine, and each interstellar fragment carries a story from eons past. Perhaps 3I slash ATLAS is a storyteller, a memory, or a messenger. And perhaps we, in this brief moment of awareness, are its chosen audience. As we watch it drift silently, we feel humility, awe, and reflection. The universe may be alive, aware, and capable of expressing itself, not in words, but in energy, light, and motion. And in witnessing this, we are reminded that our curiosity is part of the cosmos's own memory. If Harvard's observations are correct, then humanity may need to rethink what interstellar visitors really are. Could 3I slash ATLAS be emitting energy powerful enough to interfere with satellites, probes, or even future missions? Space is not quiet. It is dynamic, energetic, and sometimes unpredictable. We've grown used to thinking of the cosmos as a tranquil stage. But this visitor reminds us of its power, its fragility, and our vulnerability. One small object pulsing with unknown energy can shift the trajectory of our understanding and perhaps the delicate balance of life orbiting our small blue planet. There is no need to panic, but there is a need to pay attention. Humanity has always explored the unknown, and part of exploration is recognizing the risks as well as the wonders. And yet with mystery comes hope. Every anomaly, every pulse, every question raised by 3I slash A-T-L-A-S invites us to grow, to dream, to learn. Future generations may decode interstellar signals, travel to distant worlds, and speak with the cosmos in ways we can only imagine today. Even at our age, we are part of this story. Every discovery, every observation contributes to humanity's ongoing journey. Wonder does not retire. Curiosity never fades. And as we watch the green pulse, we realize that the universe is speaking, teaching us patience, humility, and vision. 
Perhaps one day we will understand these cosmic messages. Until then, the journey itself, guided by curiosity, hope, and imagination, is the reward. Perhaps somewhere in that green light, the universe is whispering. It's time to understand. The comet drifts silently, its heartbeat fading gently into the void. Stars twinkle around it, witnesses to a cosmic drama older than humanity itself. We feel awe, gratitude, and a quiet connection. We have glimpsed something extraordinary. We have been part of a story that spans billions of years. And in that silence, we sense the universe is alive, speaking in light, pulsing in rhythm, waiting for us to listen. And now I ask you, if you could witness one event in the cosmos before you leave this world, what would it be? The birth of a star, a comet streaking across the night sky, or a signal from another civilization? Take a moment to imagine it, reflect. And if you feel inspired, share your thoughts in the comments. The story continues. AstroMind will be here, exploring, wondering, and reaching for the secrets that the universe has yet to reveal.